Sam here at Ansier Wynton Chevrolet and we're gonna do a little experiment, all right? So we know it gets very, very hot in cars during the summer, duh. But how many of you have one of these? I've never owned one before and I wonder how much difference do they really make when it comes to the temperature inside of our cars? We're gonna find out. Truck number one has the sunshade. Not exactly the perfect fit, but we're not gonna get into details. Here goes our thermometer. Right now it's reading about 90 degrees. We're gonna set it here and wait a few minutes. Okay, truck number two, not as fun because no sunshade and it's already really hot. My upper lip is sweating. I'm getting that. It's a lot of upper lip sweat. Same thing, thermometer here. It's already reading closer to 100, so we'll check back on these guys in a few minutes. All right, it's been about five minutes. Our thermometers have each been sitting on the dash. Again, this is the vehicle with the sunshade. Even with the sunshade, reading right at 100 degrees. Okay, this is the one with no sunshade, so no sun protection. And this boy is maxed out over 130 degrees. I'm sure if it could have kept rising, it would have. So a 30 degree temperature difference at least between the two vehicles. Bottom line, doesn't matter what kind of car you have, it's gonna be hot in the summertime, but at least you can cut yourself a little bit of slack by getting one of these because as you can see, it does make a difference. 